Okay, so this is a simple example of how we can use a script written in Outim Designer to let you export the milling path for a P milling a PCB on a Roland milling machine. So I've got a basic uh, design here, double-sided, through-hole design. Uh, you'll find that in one of the reference designs within the Outim installation and what we're going to do is install the script which is also in the installation so if you go down here into the scripting system global projects and install and then you need to go to the program files out in designer examples scripts delphi script pcb mill exporter now you only have to do that once this is just setting up the global project. So now that you've got that there, you can actually go in and run script and select the run mill exporter. Okay, and you'll be presented with this dialog box. So this is where you set up all the parameters for your milling machine and there are some basic configurations which have been put into the system um, but if you ever need to uh, go in and create your own or to edit those settings then you can do so from within here as well. So they should all be set up. Take note of this X and Y table because we'll need those in just a moment when we um, go into Vmodella. Uh, OK, I'll export and export. So what's actually happening now is that the script creates some polygons on the board and it uh, uses the path that was used in those polygons to become the new mill routing path and as you can see there as it's doing all of that it's actually creating these RML command language or command files so they get actually saved in the same location as your um, project so if we actually have a look at those you can see those in there so now when we go into vmodella and you'll know in this new workspace you'll notice that the dimensions for the workpiece are exactly the same as what they were for the model uh, for the machine that we're actually using so OK and then we'll import I've already done these before so you can see that's the top layer and we'll import the bottom layer as well and what you actually see here is that it's pushed the top layer is milled based on the bottom left hand corner and then the idea is that you flip the board over and align the board to the bottom right hand corner of the milling machine and then you can mill the bottom layer and hopefully everything will line up if you're pushing up hard against the edge on both sides. Let's just uh, have a look at this in slightly more detail. So I'll have to drill this right down into one fifth which is going to be quite. We'll just do the top layer so you can get the idea. All right. So here we are, this is our board, and you can see that it's milled around all of the, the tracks and the vias and everything, and it's also put, put spot holes uh, with each of the, um, the vias and uh, through hole pads. So that's how you export a RML file from Altium Designer. And I think actually we've got some pictures of it actually milling the board out from within one of the milling machines. Enjoy!